The primary objective of the training is to improve the administrative approach to sports development and to ensure sports administrators strive for effective management within all sporting disciplines in the country. It was a very tense course, and the days were not very easy to all of you, because the course ran through the Olympic movement, its foundation, how it started, and also how it was modernized. And one of the topics we learned here is about good governance. That stage is more than only governance in sport, but governance in terms of administration. The course is expected to enable participants to contribute meaningfully to the development of sports at all levels and to catch up with rapid advancements across the globe, influenced in part by the huge interest in sports, especially among the youth. Sport is a key role to women. Uh, they taught us here that we, they want to see more women on administrative job, uh, coaching and all such of things because, yeah, it's not easy that. Uh, as a team, much more females, anything you are doing, you should what put there what have aims and objectives. As we, uh, sport is considered, we want to see all sporting activities, all sport programs to stay in any female uh, category. We want to lead, lead, see that females are leading all those activities rather than giving it to men. Alaji Usman Wada, second vice president, GNOC, emphasized that the training is based on the Gambia National Olympic Committee's strategic plan, which accords high priority to training and skills development geared towards enhancing standards and ensuring quality delivery within the sporting fraternity and across all national sports associations. I am glad to say that this sports administrative course has come at an opportune moment when Gambian sport is taking the bottom-up approach in terms of its development from the grassroots level. We therefore solicit the support of each and every one for sports development to be intensified at all levels of our society. Amilo, a participant from the Gambia Handball Association, said the training is timely considering the rising number of female athletes in various sports. Madam Lo added that such training programs play a crucial role in reducing and preventing sexual harassment in sports. We, the female administrators and coaches, have learned and ready to serve to deliver in our different associations. We are appealing for more trainings like this. We want to have a confident, comfortable environment to showcase our talents without fear. The week-long training introduced participants to sporting events, management of trips, strategic planning, anti-doping, sports science, medicine and technology in sports among others. Alajimbai, GRTS Sports.